Hey all, how are you doing? It's Reg from Average Guy. I'll be honest with you. I'm building a lander like this one that we have here to go to Mars or to Jupiter. And it is kicking my butt like big time. Um, I've got some interesting clips of my working on it, so I'm going to put together just a clip package, but it, it'll come. Uh, it's kicking my butt because Jupiter's gravity is so strong that just trying to slow down enough that I can land on a moon with a heavy payload, like what we have here, is it's ki it's kicking. And I'm using the, you know, extra large builds and everything to try to do it. I've got fuel stations, like docking stations. I'm going to do a video just on the docking station itself. For It's a fuel depot, basically, to have it so I can get into orbit, go to the fuel depot, fill up, and then go there. But because it's been kicking my butt so much, I'm trying something different. Uh, I am also want to build a probe to enter the jupiter atmosphere same story it's kicking my butt because of the gravitational field i hit jupiter going so fast and i hit it with big thrusters trying to slow down enough i'm almost 12 twelve thousand uh, kilo meters per second by the time i get up there so yeah it's it's moving so yeah it's it's going to take a bit anyway this one is what we're going to do is another Mars hit and uh, what we're going to do is try to land on one of the Martian moons take off and come back because there's rocks there we haven't got yet and so I think it's important to get them but I did find a few things remember every now and then I tell you the line disappears on me it's the bloody moon that's what's happening is the moon is passing in between and the line completely disappears because it says you're going to the moon, even though I'm not going to the moon. So it, you'll see some of the videos when I'm showing that. And, and you've, you've seen a few so far where it's happened. But there you go. We're going to go with this little lander again. It worked really good going to Mars and coming back. So let's just give it a shot and see if we can get it onto one of the moons. It should be interesting because the moons are significantly lighter, right? So... I'm thinking just for balance wise, I'm going to put a couple of legs on this guy. Just this outer tank here. So that way we have the ability to land on some legs. Let's see if that's yeah, that's plenty long enough. Okay, so there's the only change I'm doing to this thing. Uh, other than that, it was successful before. So let's go again. Uh, I'm going to just call this Mars Moon Lander because it's slight change. Okay, so we should be good for staging. So let's just give her. And I'm starting to schedule out my videos. So I'm not doing like six at a time. It's They'll be spread out so that way. Uh, make it a little bit more reasonable to expect people to watch them. I'm... I might actually still have one like one a day or something like that, but I'll have it come out at like, you know, four o'clock my time in the afternoon. And then that way, when people are done for the day, they can come home, watch one of them as they're relaxing. Okay, let's see where we are. Yeah, doing good. I'm 
just gonna let myself get some altitude here before I start leaning over some more. There we go. Okay, so the middle one's out. We've done this one before, so it should it should get us into an orbit that we can go to Mars with. It's not a new one. Those main thrusters, their goal is to get us into space, and they did. Okay, so let's phase out here. There we go. Just about into orbit. Okay, off to Mars. Ooh. It's right behind me. Hopefully the moon doesn't mess with us on this one. That's the thing with an X, Y, Z coordinate, and you could plan it so that doesn't happen, but when you're working on a flat plane, it's a little bit more, well, it's easier, but it's a little bit more difficult for something like that. So we have the path to Mars. Let's get the the window to jump out. I'm hoping Mars doesn't kick my butt today too, like Jupiter has been. Off we go. So far, we're looking good. This is the line I was talking about that disappears sometime. And it's just because it says, oh, you're running into the moon. Okay. 
Now we go to the moon, or to Mars, and there's my orbit, or my trajectory. It's not an orbit yet. So, I'm hoping to land on Deimos, Deimos, I think it's pronounced. That's the goal. Okay. Touchy thrusters. <laughs> okay, let's go. Coming in. Now, before we get too close, I'm going to turn things around a bit. And try to see if we can get a connecting or, or position to get to the planet, or into an orbit anyway. There it is. There's my encounter. And it is a little potato. <laughs> That's what it looks like anyway. So when we get there, we gotta really do our best to not overshoot it. Because it is just a little potato. It's very small. Both of the moons of Mars are slowly drifting away. Or one's going to drift in and hit, and uh, Deimos here is going to float away. But neither of them for a long, long time. So 
if Elon gets us there and we start building a base, we got a long time before we have to worry about it. There we go. So we are in an orbit, and why can I not? turned her around and actually came to a stop which is kind of funny Let's see where we are. Just using thrusters now. Just trying to get into an orbit around this thing. So we're coming in very slowly.
here we go. We have an orbit. Took a little bit. We're just going at a very slow movements here. We're only going at 4.6. So, we will eventually land. <laughs> as long as I don't bounce off it. That's the... go faster but it's just I've not landed anything on here before that's why you don't see one of my uh, probes on here and I am not gaining any speed like I'm staying at a consistent oh gained a little bit of speed there now we're at 2.6 we're at 2.5 <laughs> for the longest time there so the whole thing with this one now is just patience and waiting and the guys are getting all excited. They're getting their tools together because they know that it'll be a little while yet before they land. And then they'll hop back in the seats for the, the final landing. Where's the potato? There it is. Wow. It's hard to even do the thruster slow enough here. Here it comes. Everybody excited? Don't go too fast. There we go. Nice little poof into the soil. Wait for it to register. There we go. Landed on Demos. There. We, we have a success for the day. <laughs> so, next video is going to be taking off on Demos and going back home. A success. <laughs> Don't give up. That's the big one. Don't give up. Okay. So, thanks very much. Uh, please do hit the subscribe button there. And... Uh, it's about time. It, I was, don't give up. Yeah, so hit the subscribe, hit the like, and I will see you guys on the way back. So go collect your rocks and, <laughs> that sounded bad. I'll see you in the next one.